Daily electrician skills. How can a beginner quickly master contact dots? First, connect a neutral and a live wire to this contactor's A2 terminal. Once connected, the circuit breaker can control the contactor's pull-in, but switching the breaker every time you start the contactor is very troublesome. You can add a start button. We connect the start button as normally open. Just cut the wire in the middle. This way, we can press the button to activate the circuit. Now starting the contactor is very convenient, but as soon as I release my hand, it disengages. Isn't this just momentary operation? But I want it to stay engaged when I press it once. At this point, we need to use the contactor's normally open contact for self-latching. We connect a wire from here to the contactor's normally open, and then from the normally open to coil A2. Now, pressing it once allows for self-latching. When I start it, power flows from here directly to the coil. There's also power here, a momentary press, and power instantly goes from the normally open contact to the coil, then it self-locks and stays energized. Now to turn it off, I'd need to trip the breaker. So we add a stop button, cut the wire in the middle and connect the stop button as normally closed. Press start, it pulls in. Press stop, it turns off. That's self-locking.